If it was somebody else, well, it's Venon. And welcome back to Dark Side Detective. Today we're gonna jump into the case number three, Disorient Express. So let's do it. Case summary. Dooley has called me to the subway station to deal with an emergency. Have to get used to the text. It's yeah. You know what? It kind of mixes in front of my eyes. Oh, and I remember that Dooley was supposed to. Uh, I was supposed to give him the British accent. Sorry for all the Brits. Okay. Uh, just in case. Officer Dooley, detective, you're here. <laughs> detective McQueen. I came as soon as he called. What's the case? Is he barefoot? No. No, he has brown shoes, right? Case? No, I just need a ride. Station's closed. Closed? Yeah, some spooky train is blocking the, blocking the platform. Anyway, let's go. A spooky train? Yep, spooky train. Anyway, we better get going or we'll be late to work. Do we? It's a spooky train. We're the dark side division. Do you not think we should kind of take care of it? I try not to. That's very... Th th that's detective work. Let's go have a look then, shall we? Fine, but if we miss the free donuts at work, you're buying. Alright, 666 Street. I can say I'm surprised to find something that something strange is happening here. Yeah, where else? Where else? Alright, Subway. Dooley, do you have anything else to say? I have to remember to ask Dooley every time to talk with Dooley every time we enter a new location. By the way, um, this game involves a lot of reading, so I have a full set of different things to drink as I'm reading all the things. And I have. Um, there was a funny video about the one is for hydration, one is for the taste, and one is for something else. Yeah, it's me. I have water, I have juice, and I have warm tea. I am prepared. I will pee so bad, <laughs> but I am prepared, so cheers to you guys. Starting strong with tea. Okay. Let's get on with this waste of time, nothing happening here, investigation then. Okay, red lights, sure. And the car? Are you sure? Oh, are you sure we can't just go to work? I need to get my morning nap in. What time is it then? Squad car. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's anything else, so let's go to the subway. Subway. Well hydrated, thank you. Uh... Flickering light. Do you have anything to say about it? Flickering lights always just spooky hijinks. Yes. Cops is dumb. I don't think that's how you spell it, right? I'm not, uh, you know, English is not my first language, but I'm, I'm really sure this is not how it's written. Not as dumb as your grammar, kid. Okay. Yeah. Kid. <laughs> Did you do that? Dooley. Dooley, please. Dooley, no. Seems to be working, but I have no cash. Time to put this badge to work and make use of my police privileges. Yeah, why would you buy a ticket? Not if you're investigating, come on. Do you subway often? No, before we had the squad car, I tended to take taxis. That sounds expensive. <laughs> Snob. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Did you say something just then? What? Me? No, 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 no. <laughs> this is something I do a lot with my friends. So basically whenever I say something stupid, just to get somebody's reaction, and you wait for the what? And then I say, what? <laughs> I recommend that. It's really, really funny. Okay, anyway. Um, ticket machine using the badge. We're going through the barrier. Sorry, detective, the bar is broken. We have no crawl. Ah, we have to crawl laundry. Okay, can't, can't we at least just jump over? No, the insurance for jumping was too high. We're only clear for a slow crawl. <laughs> why? 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 Being a cop is nothing like television promised it would be. Yeah, where, where's the action? Where's the bombarding? Why is there a ghost? 
of the conductor. Eerie train. Oh, all right. Dooley, what do you think? See, it's just spooky. It is just spooky. Generically spooky. Generic. Okay. Nothing special about it. Let's go get donuts. Dooley, it's glowing. <laughs> Maybe it's pregnant? <laughs> what? It's glowing? Your face is glowing. Okay. Maybe it's pregnant? No. Pregnant? Brigante. Information. No. Basker. Oscar the Grouch. Oh, he sings it. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Anki Sam don't want you to know. About the truths I'm here to show, so it makes me frown. When I smell me a pig and his dumb side king comes to shut me down. Side king is in the word. Poetic license. Pig. How dare you, I'm gonna arrest you. I would arrest you. But you are not the main suspect of this case. So I will not. Alright. So. Hello, conductor. Conductor Gill, do you have a ticket, sir? A ticket? Thought not. I'm afraid I'll have to ask you solids to leave. Did you just call us solids? Certainly not, sirs. I would be throwing around language. I wouldn't be throwing around language like that. Who are you? A train's conductor, sir. Right, you look a tad ghostly, sir. That I do. That I do. Are you ghosts? Not at all, sir. Ghosts are blue, for one. And they can't be seen. Not without the proper equipment. No, we're from the dark side. Then, what are you doing here? Train stuck, sir. Doing my job to keep the passengers safe while this gets rectified. Okay. Rectified? Yes, sir. I'm sure those boys from the Bright Side Division are looking into it right now. Are we the Bright Side, Div the bright side Division? Is this how you call us? Bright Side Division. Right. Are we the Bright Side Division? But we call ourselves Dark Side Division? Because we deal with the Dark Side? Huh. Ah, with the Dark Side. Come to the Dark Side. Why are you here? Just as, as I said, sir, trains stuck. Not sure what caused it. Likely a problem with the trucks, sir. We have to see inside the control rooms to be sure, but I can't leave my post here. Alright, come back anytime, sir. I will. Can I enter the train? I don't have tickets, so probably not, but let's see. There's something about this green, transparent and eerie train that suggests it's not meant to be here. It is not. It's from the dark side. Okay. Dooley, what do you think? What? Why do they, ha Why do they have a bone room? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> That's a spanner, not a bone. Why would they have a bone room? What even is a bone room dually? That's a conversation you need to have with your parents, detective. Boner? No. Uh, I wonder if this camera caught any useful footage, but it can't see that the working light is painted on. But I can't see that the working light is painted on. Oh no! It looks legit! This is what people do, right? They just pretend. Plunger. But without the plungy bit. Oh. So a stick then. I got a handle. Okay, first item of the case. Nice. Let's see. There is a bin. Mm, there seems to be something in here. And a receipt. A glowing receipt. Okay, it belongs to the train. The control room is locked for now. Dooley! 
Oh, come on, detective. You know as well as I do how these things go on. Okay. And toilets. <gasps> toilets are always creepy in horror games. Alright. Dudley, what do you think? Whatever happens in here, detective, don't cross the streams. Is it boys' rules? Hmm. I need to get my eyebrows blocked. There's a rat here. Well, not anymore. Cubicle? Oh! Hello! Do you mind if I ask you some questions? You need some toilet paper. I'm in a bit of a paint. Of a bind, daddy -o. Um, hi there. Oh, sorry, the door was unlocked. Yeah, locks broke. And I've no feet to hold against it. Right. Well, um, I'll leave you to it. Yeah, it doesn't have feet. Well, hold up, daddy -o. I'm in a bit of a funky situation. Maybe you could help me out? What is it? Still has no toilet paper, daddy -o. And I'm a cat that needs him some. Yeah, uh, sure, sure, we can look. Do you want to use the receipt? Because it's glowing. No, he needs toilet paper. It has to be toilet paper. Okay. Another stall? Shush, you rat. Shush. Oh, that's a bidet. Of sorts. What on earth is that? Not sure, but I think we should send it back to whether to wherever it came from. I tried to flush, but to no use. You could say that it is intensical on staying where it is. <laughs> no. I need to find something to push it down with. The plunger, but it's not here. We just have the, the stick handle. That's some lazy graffiti. I always put in more effort when talking subways. What? You heard me, Nark. Sue me. <laughs> okay, I don't have to shush away the rat. Fine, fine. There's the toilet paper. Creepy or not, nobody deserves to be stranded without toilet paper. Amen. We have some toilet paper and a toilet. That noise reminds me of my career since I was assigned to the dark side division. That's sad. Do you want to talk about it? Oh, did you want to talk about something in the cabin? Why do you always follow me into these tight spaces? Well, you know what they say about friends in tight spaces. No, me neither. All right, okay. Fake excuses. All right. Okay, listen. Hey, Daddyos, did you get that toilet paper for me? Yeah. Here you go. Here you go, guy. Sorry to leave you ho hoovering for so long. For out, Daddyo. Here, take this coin and thanks. A cold coin? Can we bribe? <laughs> Not buy a ticket. Can we bribe? <laughs> First thought. Well. Oh? Another flickering light? It wouldn't be a dodgy underground bathroom without a flickering light. Yeah. Also, I wouldn't be a secret... It wouldn't... It also wouldn't be a secret rave venue. Hmm? What was that? The thing, detective? Dooley, you're so outspoken today. Alright, I think that's all from here. What do we need the coin for? We could try with the ticket machine, maybe? Maybe, question mark? There is a receipt here as well. Do you have a ticket, sir? I have a receipt? An idea what this is? I know what it's not, sir. It's not ticket onto this train. Goodbye. Goodbye, then. I'd say we could try the occult. What, what, what's gonna happen? There's not a chance in hell that this will work. Well. Well, well, well. Oh, why? Of course. You received item. A ticket. 
kind of ticket is that? A train ticket I purchased with this strange coin that Darksider gave me. So this might be a ticket for the train. Here we go. One ticket. Fine. On you go then, I suppose. Haha! <laughs> More people. Alright, give me a sip sip. He looks cool. Everybody looks cool. Let's start with party guy. I like your glasses. Da. They're my party goggles. On your way to a party? Always drink. D Darling. Okay. This is where we're going. Okay. Always Darling. Every... Oh my god. It's so hard to read. Every place is party place when I have my goggles in. And I always have my goggles in. Even here. No. We party on the train. Alright. Is it smelly or is it just a fog? Mm. Oh, Dooley, what do you think? Everyone here is so sick looking. It's not that they're not sick, they're transparent. I can see right through them. I've always been impressed with your scrutiny skills. Thank you, Dooley. Thank you. Alright, hippie girl. Because she has a flower. Is this everything that you need? Come on. Well, hello there. Hiya! Where are you off to? I was on my way to San Frankenstein Cisco, obviously. But then we got stuck here. This place is terrifying. How so? Well, for a start, there's not a single screaming beast in the sky. Nobody's being followed by shadow men and nothing is on fire. Nothing. Maybe you're not the girl for me. Maybe not. Maybe not. What will Granny say? Nanny Dooley? Is that you? Granny G. Sorry, dearie. I'm Granny Gooley. You do look like my little Patrick, though. My name's Patrick, too! It's like with Martha. Okay. Do you also like games of I Spy as a child? I did! I did! I spy with my little eye, the coming of the end, the world eating itself, rivers of gold flooding the streets. I don't... I don't know this version of the game. <laughs> Seeing the end times was little Patrick's favourite. No, so cheerful. Ah, oh, oh, Granny. Mm. Think different Granny. Oh! A dark side portal. It appears we found our number one suspect for all these strange goings on. You have the right to remain silent when questioned. Anything you say or do may do we. What are you doing? Reading it, its rights. And how exactly do you intend to arrest it? With my handcuffs, obviously. Top marks for enthusiasm, do we? We have to walk through the portal. Oh boy, okay. Yeah, let's do it. Looks like the purple rift has an accomplice. I'm going to need a second pair of handcuffs. <laughs> well, was not enough, okay. Julie, what do you think? Is what heck of a light show they've got going on down here. Delete their portals to the dark side. We're in the dark side right now. Of course it's dark. We're on the ground. That's probably why they've lit it up like this. Who do I have to work with? Why? Why does this always happen to me? Why? We're stuck with you, Dooley. I adore you, but god damn it, look at your arm. What happened here? Alright. Sorry. Agent Max Cream. Is it me, but with a beard? You look familiar. As the fire recognized the flame, does the darkness recognize the shadow? Does the storm recognize the wind? Rain? 
Damn it, man. I've lost my train of thought. I didn't do anything. Didn't do anything. So you're an agent here, huh? We are all agents of the newer, never-ending hunt. Servants of the crawling death void. Ministers of the world's cruelty. Well, I'm happy you're doing okay for yourself. Thanks. It's been a lot of hard work and late nights at the office. Huh. So tell me, any idea of what's going on? Interlopers. Fiends. Fleshy monstrosities. Things that should not have come to pass. Tracks of chaos intertwine. Are we speaking the same language? It's very hard to understand. Agent Max Scream reminds me of Doctor Strange. The yeah, the wording kind of yeah. It's not much of an idea right now, then. No. <laughs> I like when they use big words and they you ask them a straightforward question. They're like very short answer. I like it. So receding hairline. How's that treating you? How dare you? But I will ask. The end comes for us all. Entropy is a cruel mistress. Yeah, let's hope it's from growing up in this weird hole. And it won't happen to me. And it won't happen to me. Oh, poor guys. Poor guys worrying about the hairline. I'd best be going. We had all best be going. We had all best be going to the places we would best be at. Wise words. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I know why, but this yeah I heard in the voice of uh, Keanu Reeves. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're here. Anything else here? No, let's go to the train. F <gasps> Raksa! We've met Raksa before! Okay, alright. At the library. Finally, somebody in authority. Conductor Al. Hey! Sorry, guy, but you don't know any more than the rest of us. Hi, Detective. What's going on? Raksa? Why are you here? Getting the train home from college. Then we got diverted to wherever this is. Well, we're on the, ca we're on the case now, so get comfortable. Sorry, that was dooley. He means... No, yeah, I get it. Let me know if I can help at all. Will do. You probably will. Probably will, because you're very knowledgeable about the dark side. Alright, Julie, what do you think? See? These people look hit. Oh, these people look healthier. That's because they're alive, Julie. Playing video games, listening to music, indulging in mind altering substances. I guess they're living life to the fullest. Right. That's the definition. Okay. So, we talked to Raxa. There's. Headphones. Is it a nickname for a guy? Headphones. Hello? Do we? Now we know what you dream of. Mm, yeah. He's a rebel. I wonder if he knows what's going on. No, it's just a very, strangely, a very long ride home. And he doesn't even know why. Stay back, monster! Whoa, whoa, calm down. Sorry, I thought you were him. Him? The intense man in the tunnel? Intense man, okay. In the tunnel who threatens to arrest and or eat anyone who gets off the train. Arrest or eat? Yep, and I'm not sure who chooses... <laughs> What's going on here? You're not... You're really not him. I, I don't really know what happened. We left the last station in time, then some weird lights flashed and now we're here. Wherever here is. Okay. Who's the man you keep talking about? The guy outside. Just listen to your own brain. He, he looks a bit like you. Only not. Not at all now that I see you. Properly see you. There's a reasoning Caroline and me. He's... He talks about outside this train, sniffing for clues and snarling when he sees us. Uh, has he heard anyone so far? Thankfully, no. He seems more menacing than dangerous. That's good. 
Poor pink shirt person. Oh, we're gonna see in a second. If you need anything else, I'll be here. Sorry about the mix up earlier. No problem. Who is that pink waster? What what is a waster? Who is a waster? Tommy. He has a name. Hey dude. We've been on the train for ages. What's going on? Like he's wasted? I'm afraid because I keep seeing floating green people. I'm not a liber heh. <laughs> I think I indulged a little too much this morning. That's how I'm imagining. You probably shouldn't tell me that. I'm an officer at of the law. <laughs> Far out, dude. Never mind. Now you know. Now you know, Leonis. Now you know. There's a fire extinguisher. In case of fire, pray somebody has ever fueled the extinguisher. <laughs> they have not. They have not. Oh, uh, we're doomed. Okay. Out to a warning sign. If you find yourself in a parallel dimension, please stay in the carriage. An oddly useful warning. Huh. Huh. Okay. I should probably stay with these people. Make sure they're okay. You're tired from walking through the tunnels, aren't you? Stop using your Sherlock powers on me. Okay. Ghost cop. Oh no, and Dooley stayed there? But the ghost cop! That's so cool! Sorry, I really like ghosts. Changing position, adjusting. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I think I'll go with a little bit of juice. Katie, hello! How are you doing? What's up? <sighs> okay. No then, no then, no then. You look like one of those. Croc. Thank you for using the aliens. Thank you. You look like one of those living folk we've got plodding about the place right now. Officer Dooley? Name is Gooley, Chief of the Brightside Division. So th okay, parallel worlds. Okay. Brightside Division. Specialist deal with threats from your neck of the woods, so as to speak. My neck of the woods? The older world. That which from whence you came, son. I don't think he's British. He smells American accent to me, but I can't do any American accent, sorry. I surmise from your appearance that you are a dead tech t if I'll bite one down this lark. Hey! I presume that being the case, you've crossed over to investigate your world's version of this situation. Situation? I am! Can you help? No, son, I cannot. This isn't your jur is jurisdiction. You should leave this to us professionals and take care of our train back in your own world. Shouldn't you look into that? Jurisdiction, son. Ma seems like a concept beyond a dangerous maverick such as yourself. Maybe I should slap you behind bars. Please don't. Brutal. Yeah, absolutely. Please don't slap me. Train, train, train. Basker. Sing me a song, buddy. Quack. I should move this. Wait, wait, wait. Thank you, thank you for parking. Sound. It's gonna go here. Alright. Thank you, thank you. That's how buskers work here, you tourist. Oh. Alright. We can go upstairs, we can go down the platform. No. It's a restricted area. Classified personnel only. Are you a classified personnel? No, I did not think so. On account of myself and Max Cream being the only ones who is. So unless you is one of us, I suggest you step back, son. Step back! And he gets out the gun. Okay, serious stuff. Let's go upstairs. Tickets. There is the platform. 
Is this is this machine crying? What? Crying? No. Mold. A dark patch of fuzzy mold. I think it's looking at me. Oh, it's a it's a beard. We're gonna pretend to access some places, right? Alright. Can we go outside? We can. <gasps> Come get me from the station, he said. A routine, he said. Yes. <laughs> Costume shop. Given how little I know about... Can you hear the sounds? <gasps> Given how little I know about this place, how this place works, they could sell costumes or turn you into one. Oh, that could be helpful. What horrors could it possibly make the news here? Mayor points of camera! <gasps> oh. Trains do not run on time, they run on fuel. Trains will also be late. Okay, some things are universal, I suppose. Yeah, debris. Most of the dark side city appears to be in ruin. Oh, sky. It hurts my eyes to look. Okay, let me catch the bird. Give me the bird. No, I don't think it changes. Is your day beautiful? Just like you. <gasps> Kate, you know what to say. It's it's really going well. Yeah, I'm happy about it. Flying terror. Okay, maybe we can catch it. Just a normal. What the hell was that? Flying terror. I told you before. Can we go into the dark side shop? We can. Oh, okay. These are not semi-translucent because they are mannequins. Okay. Took me took me by surprise. Pirate outfit. Amaze your friends, surprise your enemies, confuse real pirates with this inefficient pirate ensemble. Comes with a free press ganging. What is press ganging? I do not know. If you look like this man, this might be a mirror. Also, you may be wanted by the police for questioning. Funny. Hehe. <laughs> I like the cashier. Let's talk to him. An invisible person. Welcome, sir. It's our, that is to say, me and I's pleasure to welcome you to costume shop. Is there a two in one kind of thing here? So that is the name. Your broken sign wasn't very clear. If it ain't broke, don't fix it, my old fella said. And if it is broken, maybe don't fix it anyway, he dad. Very practical man he was. How can I aid you, sir? Trying to intimidate your direct superior at work? Hoping to wow a six-armed lover? Tired of looking like a hobo? Hey! That's our motto. Whatever you shame, spiders got you covered. Alright. Biker outfit, oh that would be cool. Be a badass biker. Bike not included. <laughs> Are you still a biker without a bike? Be a badass walker. Hell yeah. Assuming you're an ass assuming your ass is bad. Either in the dangerous sense or the missing a box away, your call. Did you write this advert yourself? No, sir. Came that way, sir. Good words. Ain't they, sir? No. His personality is different from his appearance. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. A snarky teenage wizard is welcome anywhere. Well, not so much welcome as he'll turn up and then he'll be there. And it's almost as much hassle to get rid of him as it is to just leave him be. That's my usual party vibe anyway, so two thumbs up from me. Nice. Wig and mustache. Punk wig. Cash register. Sir, so I'll ask you mighty nice not but once. Keep your sausage fingers from my money box. Okay, sir. What if I do it again? Okay, I thought that maybe I'll trigger him. Alright. Alright. A wig and moustache. 
What's this one? It looks normal enough to me. Normal, sir. Why, that's the very pillar Summers... Ooh? Very pillar Summers are built on, sir. A friend and mentor to those in need. A shoulder to cry on a person who live in a wood hut with no air conditioning. The legendary camp counselor, sir. Nobody would buy that as a camp counselor. Oh, but they do, sir. It's the moustache, sir. Shows him to be rocked wilderman, suited for the rough and tumble life of a camp counselor. Not for timid folk like you and I, sir. No, sir. Not for shop vendors and cold warmers. Uh oh. And the punk? Dress like a punk. Or a road warrior from the future. Yeah. Or um, you could wear this and be a, I don't know, a Karen? Well, I am con I'm convinced. Let's say conceived. But that's different. And the box? It's full of ones and zeros. How would anyone wear these? Says so. While wearing a brown bin bag. How dare you? Come on, guys. This is a nice coat. And they say the customer is always right. Oh, do, would you know anything about the receipt? One tick, sir. Oh, Miss... Miss Biscotti, I just beg your pardon, Miss. I should have known, obvious to me now it is. Yeah? I'll get your items for you now, Miss. Oh, um, yes. Thanks. Then here you go, Miss. One swim cap. Thanks, I guess. I got a swim cap, so it, it was from here. All right. Oh, we're gonna be bold. Because it's skin colored. All right. All right. Anything else here? I would say no. So, let's go further. Outside. The Daily Chronicle can't go left, right? A oh, burning barrel, how could I not see that? Ah, help! I'm on fire! Detective McQueen, what on the... Aha! A burning trash barrel! I meant to be on fire, you gong! The look on your face! Brilliant! I'm... I'm not even... I don't have a face, dude. Screw you! They're mean here, yeah. Yeah, I don't like it. We're going. We're going away from here. Back to the platform. Should we... Should we wear this? I need to find something to complete this disguise before I put it on. I guess I can dress up as Agent Max Cream whenever I want. Yay? But the disguise. Yeah, he had some hair. Come on. Time to try this. I can't bring myself to call it a disguise. Time to try whatever this is out, I guess. <laughs> All right. Do you think so? No, I've not seen my share of these guys. Is this one particularly poor? With what it partially made up of some fungus, and you lacking a certain floaty transparent quality. That was a worth. It was worth a shot. Stop right there, criminal scum! I'm here. I'm here. No action to be interrupted. Oh, but I see that, Elionis, you have some urge to destroy. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Burn them CDs. It was. I wish that agent I was sent was so innovative. I tell you what, son. If you go, maybe you can solve this thing after all. What about jurisdiction? <coughs> jurisdiction. Our paperwork up a solution now off you up before I change my mind. Right, thanks. Okay, here we go. It didn't work, but then it kind of did. Alright. Control room. Can we enter? We can. There's a poster. Looks like he hung in there for too long. Yeah, fair. Key rack. Who doesn't like having keys? I'm gonna have a key. 
I'm not saying she loves me. She loves me not. Nice. Healthy relationship. Line one, power control system. All systems operating correctly. Everything seems to be working correctly here. Let's not touch anything in case I... I change that. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oops. If it works, it works. We're going. It's full of pictures of you. Playing the game. Where a tiny pixel man looks in a trash can at pictures of you. <laughs> wow, what an inception. Alright, that was fun. Toilets. Looking good, Frankie. Reflection talks back. I think you've let yourself go. Shut up, Reflection! Wait, what? What? <laughs> this cubicle is... Haunted. It's nailed shut. Maybe it's for good. Unknowable thing. Growling, scratching, banging on the door. Ah. I hope that barring holds. Okay. Where did it hold it off? Okay. Next cubicle. This place looks familiar. Either that's a clue or there is one lazy artist hanging around here. Hmm. Huh. This place looks familiar. Okay. <gasps> the middle one was when the tentacle was, wasn't it? Ah, the water goes both clockwise and counterclockwise here. W what? How? We will need a plunger from this side, I think. Right? So we can get it back on this side. Seems to be something stuck in there. That's better. Thanks. So it's called John, by the way. Thanks, um, I mean... Flush? Plunger head. Alright, let's combine this. The ultimate accessory in toilet. The bungification. The bungification. Yeah. Yeah, whatever that is. Let's try to pl plunge it. Plunge. Nothing to plunge here. You know, on this side. Can you suck it back? No? Alright. I will not be pushy. Would you like this part? No? Get that away from here. Okay? No is a no. We'll use that on the other side. And I think this is time for us to actually go back. Because this might be the key to the control room, but on the other side. So, let's go. Oh, Dooley is going with us. Okay. What did you have there? It's It smells of evidence to me. But you shall not take it beyond this place. Looks like I'll have to put this key back until I find some other way to get it past him. No! How can I... Rexa. Rexa. Any update, detective? Still investigating. Okay, well, if I can be of help, just let me know. So you can't. How do I conceal it? He still doesn't know. Conductor? No. Dooley? Yeah, we've talked about this. So I got a little bit too hasty. Can I conceal the key somehow then? Chief. Evening, making progress. Working on it. Good, keep it up, son. You're not helping too much, do you? Can't use it in the toilet. Nothing closed on this side. Huh. I'm getting stuck. Okay. There's the platform, key rack. We took the key from the key rack. A rack for keys currently keyless. Yes, because we took the key. 
from the rack. Should I just screw something up to make the detective come here? Let's just let's just have fun. Let me have my fun. No? Alright. Hmm. I don't think anything in here. My gut says no on this one. Okay. Worth trying. Worth trying. So this is evidence. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Good bit. I really liked it. Breaking the fourth wall. The platform seventy-two American going here. Busker stairs. What do you want from me? Oh, another disguise because I want to conceal something. Ah, invisible person. Welcome, miss. It's our word that is to say me and I. It's pleasure to welcome you to costume shop. So that is the name. You're broken sign. Okay. Okay, now he will be addressing us as Miss. Cool. Nothing new on that one. Okay. So I can't... No new thing. Oh, there is a poster I haven't seen before. Indecipherable blocks coming soon to a theater near you. Doesn't really change my situation, does it? My spleen. Quit it! Oh, like I'm nagging him. Okay, I understand. Uh, Badass biker. How can I conceal it? This machine crying. Do you like a key? <gasps> oh, I have an idea. I have an idea. Since they are connected and they wink winked us, can we? I don't think it will find its way to the other side without a guide. Without a guide. There's a guide. Can we get the attention of the tentacle somehow? It's it has to be something. <gasps> we need to let the beast out, don't we? Can we help it escape? We need a guy that's on the other side to help us, I think. How to do that though? Doesn't feel right. We got to snow. Nothing else. Okay. Mm. What should we do? Since it's a mirror? I can't hide it. Can't? Do you want to keep it? Oh no. Mm. Somewhere here? No. No. Doesn't feel right. Okay. <sighs> How to conceal the key? The last one doesn't have toilet paper because we gave it to the first one. Is that it? I feel like I should investigate this toilet further before feeding it keys. Oh, we didn't talk to it, did we? Did you did you just say flush? No. You definitely did. I'm a detective. I don't miss things like talking toilets. I totally missed it. 
I mean, I noticed it, but I thought, yeah, that's what it's gonna do. Oh, you got me. I can't talk. Be cool. Just do your business and move on. I ain't breaking no laws, cop. Okay, thanks. I'm talking to Holiday. And I thought I had a crappy job. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's not even. Swooper. Something in the toilet. Not even something in the toilet. The toilet. The toilet. Cut me a break. It pays the bills. Besides, I got dreams, man. I gotta be a star. Dreams. I'm gonna be a comedian, man. Wanna hear a joke? As long as they're not too <laughs> crappy. Everyone's a comedian. Forget it, man. Talk to me. Seriously, I want to hear one of your jokes. Okay. He didn't need much, did he? Why wouldn't Rex bark? He was a goldfish. Back for more? Go on. Why did the guy throw the butter out the window? He wanted to see a butterfly. Kill me. Can't stay away, can you? One more. What do you call a donkey with three legs? A wonky? No, you call it a donkey. Its physical disability should have no bearing on how you see it, you monster. I, uh... Well... Here's one for you. What's green and smelly? It always comes back to toilet humor with you humans. He see right through us. Right through us. It wasn't even a joke. That would be mean. Oh, look, Mr. Potty Mouth is back. That's just a joke. I forgive you, man. I'd hate to be a party pooper. Badoons. I'm here all week. Try the veal. I'm joking. Don't try the veal. This is a bathroom, not a fancy restaurant. I'm going now. I don't blame you. <laughs> no, I'm not. No, I'm done with this guy. Besides, I have a case to solve. Yeah, but I'm stuck. Key? Can you flash this to the other side for me? Yes. What do you think? Just what you think? Just because I can talk, I'm magical. Sorry, man. But you're on your own. Ah. Oh, not the key. The plunger. Get that away from me. He doesn't want it. No. He doesn't want to guide it either. Clockwise encounter. What does it give me? Stupid toilet. I wanted to put it into a bin here, but it doesn't work. Just plopping it whenever, wherever it doesn't work. So I don't have to consume it in any way right now. Just have to hang it back. It's not needed now. It's not needed now. And now he will let us pass. Through the train, through here, and it should work. Yes, yes. Okay, Mr. Mamas didn't like me yesterday. Oh, yesterday? What happened yesterday? Back to the platform and to the toilets, because we have some plunging to do. Right, you little sucker. <laughs> Soccer. Tentacles, very good. I should be helping, shouldn't I? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I wonder where the Wii fan lies now. Probably on the other side, isn't it? So that's what we did. That's good. What now? Thank you. Thank you. Just stream elements making drama in another stream. <gasps> oh no. Not the drama. So, go back and see what changed, right? Kind of a lot of going back and forth. 
But this is what if this is what it takes, this is what it takes. Now it's here. There's my little wrinkly body. So this is where I sent you, huh? Oh, I give okay, I think I know. I give it the key because it needs guidance, whatever. I will give it the key. Hold on to this for me, will you, buddy? Yeah. And then I plunge him back into oblivion. I mean, bright side. When I plunge you, Dave, remember that I plunge you with love. Whatever you say. Alright, and back. Because we concealed the key this way. Good, good, good. Okay, pin it up. Oh, the tentacles, yeah. Perfect. Okay. All the way back to the toilets. Give me Dave. Dave, give me. Thanks, Dave. Dave the diver. Did you name the tentacle Dave? Don't be jealous, Dooley. You're still my favorite. He's not Dave, he's Patrick. Okay, we got the key and now this was closed. So, that seems to have worked. Let's see what's behind door number two. Oh, a life, a life cat. Yes, let me ask why the tank that was such a good boy. Yeah, such a good boy. Engineer Tam. What? How do you get in? Tam locked that door from the inside. That's your handiwork, I take it. <gasps> a huge pentagram now, I realize. They shouldn't have fired old Tam for sleeping on the job. Told him he did. His black magic classes started at midnight and ran through. Morning shifts ain't for old Tam. Heavy sleeper he is. Book him duly. I left my book at the station. I Can I use these handcuffs instead? Ritual stuff. Okay. Eject. Eject. Why eject? Eject disc. Okay. There's some bad hoodoo. Tam must have installed a knockout virus on this con on the control that's causing all these problems. An old floppy disk popped out. This must be how the virus was installed. Could prove useful. Guys, do you remember floppy disks? I do. I'm old. Okay. Warning. Virus detected. Okay, and what do you do with that? The cinnamon candles remind me of Christmas though, which is nice. Old Tam always was fond of Christmas. Pappy used to buy us all trains and Mama gave us voodoo dolls. Magical time of year. Yeah, I can imagine. Get out of there, guy. I've seen what happens if you hang on if you hang on for too long. W what are you talking about? I've seen things, Dooley. Oh, Dooley. Nice work. Stop going through the trash. An unexpected but strangely relevant note. Detective? Yes. Oh, also cassette? Yes. Yes. V VHS? Yes. Have we tried turning it off and back on again? Which, the computer? I was going to say the train station. Oh, I was going to say the train station, but what you said makes more sense. I don't think we can. Yeah, I don't think we can. Alright. And with that floppy disk, stay there, do we? And make sure this guy doesn't get away. But then how is old Tam meant to escape? That's... That's kind of the point. That's not our problem. Pentagram are usually for protection. What the fuck? Of course. Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, but it's a universal sign that everybody thinks. Yeah, protection from evil, but it's just. Yeah, I absolutely agree. It's for protection. Oh, well, that ain't fair. Maybe it ain't. We'll go on the train. Go to the other side and explain? No. Get it into their computer? No thanks, I don't want to go back there. No? What do you want to do then? 
What do you want me to do? With the evil disc, cursed disc. What the? What do you want me to do? Put it into the bin? Will that get rid of it? I'm kind of confused. No. Ay, 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 ay. Help here. I wish there was the help or a hint action here in the game. Okay, we have to give it to Rax. I she will know more, apparently. All, all right then. Raxa, can you infect your computer with this? Think you can make any sense of this? Let me see. Oh, this is the cold virus. Yeah, I think it's to blame for all that's going on. I can probably talk you through how to make an antivirus on my machine. Uh, to teach you, probably. That's what I was hoping for, thanks. So, what do I do? You need to clean the infection disk sectors. Sounds easy. Not so easy. It's a virus, so each sector you clean will infect those around it. What? You can also lure the virus from infected sectors onto clean ones, cleaning the infected areas. Why would I do that? To be the virus, you have to make sure it has nowhere to hide. That will involve tricking it. I am already tricked. I already have no idea. This sounds harder than I was expecting. Don't worry, I've made a backup. I've made a backup. Just hit reset if you need me to roll back so you can start again. Thanks, okay, let's do this. So how does it work once again? I'm a genius. I'm a genius, there is no other explanation to that. Okay, I think that's it. Okay, great. And you're sure this will work? Sure is a strong word when dabbling with the occult, but I think so, yeah. Well, if it does, the city owes you big time. Really, because I'm only on this train due to a mountain of parking tickets. Well, maybe not as much. Antivirus disc. Now back? No. Should I implement it on my side then? Because I can't access their side. So the only course of action... No, 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 no. Here. This? Uploading, uh, uploading antivirus now. It should work on both sides, right? Alright! Okay. That took us some time. Okay, we did it! Great work, detective! You got the trains moving again! Do you understand what just happened here, right? No? Quack. Hmm. Quack. Let's get this guy to the cells. Ha ha ha! How are you gonna get me there? Train ain't running. We just... We just talked about how that was fixed. So weren't you listening? Plus we have this car. This has not been a good day for Tam. It has not. Case closed. Okay. Yeah, we did it. We did it. I'm glad. This one I actually got stumped and I didn't know how to proceed for the first time. Like I had to look things up. It was the hardest one so far. But it's good. It's growing in the intensity now, in the how hard it is basically. Oh, that's good. You did it! Yay! Thank you. Let's jump into police bars. Today's my day away from cases to catch up on paperwork. Will that work out for us? Well, we're starting an investigation, so I would say no. Police farce. Oh, look at us. Just chilling at the office. Ba -ba 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 -ba. You ready, detective? Huh? From McNugget's retirement party, the car caterer, oh, caterer has arrived with the cake. Grab your gift and let's go. Gift? I thought you'd forget. Don't worry, I put your name on my gift. It's from us. 
Aha! Oh, that's thoughtful. Thank you, Dooley. Hurry up, cake! Okay, there's a pin board. My notes from the open cases. The downtown ghoulie man. A possibly undead flasher. Flasher? Oh, shoot. Mirror Jane, a woman appearing in mirrors to other women who look exactly like her. Smart. Like a 2P. A wig made from werewolf hair, which turns out uh, which turns other into werewolves when worn. Maybe that should be werewolves. Huh. This is my life now. Radio. Ooh, Dick Brickman. This Twin Likes FM featuring me, Dick Brickman, bringing you Dick Brickman presents the weather with me, Dick Brickman. It's raining. Tune in later for me, Dick Brickman, presenting Dick Brickman's Tricky Kicks, not Kisses, featuring me, Dick Brickman. Nice. When all this dark side stuff is put to bed, I'm going to see the whole world. Sure. Don't postpone it, you can die any day. I actually don't know what's in these. Oh! The keys were lost before this became my office. Awesome. That's great. I'm glad that it stands here. My trusty coat goes with everything from shirt and tie to sportswear. I don't think it goes well with the sportswear. I'm sorry to say that. I don't think it does. This computer has been with me since the beginning. How long have you been working here? The budget won't allow for an upgrade. Oh, that's the context. Okay, I see. My folders of weird goings on in Twin Lakes. 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 Bin. My various attempts to file reports for the things I've seen. Alright. Offices. That's bad. Why is this broken? Maybe the motor is bust? I'll have to look at this later. You received item fan motor. Okay, uh, okay. A glass of cold refreshing. No, this is warm and oddly colored. Okay. Hmm. Just my mom. Nothing beats that first cup of coffee. It only, if only I had a slice of pie to go with it. Oh, we drank coffee and we got coffee. Do you think I'll have my own office someday? Hope so, buddy. I hope so. Do you need it? You're a cop. I'm a detective. It's different. But King's office. Okay. Um, okay. This place is fabulous. One day you could be as important as he as this. You just got to get yourself that first case. I solve cases all the time. Arresting a giant marshmallow man isn't a case. Is the result of too much coffee? It's not. Are you not taking my job seriously, do we? Mac King won this for being the best diver on the force. I don't recall anyone else being allowed to partake. Oh, that's ugly. Oh, and we got it. The trof who, who, can we get them all? This one looks homemade. Best at not being Mac Queen. That's not good, is it? Best hair on the force. Okay, I'll give him that one. You yeah, with that hair? Yeah! Yeah! Absolutely. Mark King and the chief. Wait. Is chief a woman? Or... Long haired? I guess these are the photos you get when you're married to the mayor. Oh, I see. Kolish Ostfall. Fancy chair. Supports backs. Fancy. Okay. His machine has an off button. Impressive. You don't? Oh, well. It's full of signed pictures of Mac King. Figures. Why is it here? There's space in here for pottery wheel? Holy moly. Alright. A lot of good stuff. Good stuff. Here, here, here. Okay. Next. Detective Wozinski. Okay, some Polish ancestors. 
Uh, the pressure seems gone. I should fix it before it's needed. Bust fire extinguisher. Perfect. Okay, we need some pressure. This also is screwed up. That's not good. It seems Murakami, Japanese. Murakami has set a new high score in whatever he's playing. Damn it! How am I meant to get better than him if you keep making me do work? Tell me that, eh? How dare you make me work? Broken wires. Murakami won't care if they're gone. I'm getting a lot of things and they confuse me. Officer Murakami's desk. That guy always has some reason to walk around talking to people instead of doing work. Nice. Or playing games, it seems. New? Kozinski? No tal <laughs> No talk. Working. Friendly as ever, Wojinski. Go away. Go away. Go away. Sorry, I tried to give him the Polish accent. Um, the briefing room? Oh, shoot! Okay, fire! You're meant to say surprise detective, not fire. Totally, the gifts are on fire. They sure are impressive. You stupid... Oh boy, I am going to devour that thing. Hands off, officer. We're not cutting into it yet. But Sheev, really? Is the cake really more important than the fire? Actually, who brought the fire? We discussed this last time. No more gifts of fire. Goddamn cops thinking they're Prometheus. Bloody cops. Are you not worried, McNugget? Two days left to retirement and I'm in a room with an uncontrolled fire. It's like the seams. What does a pottery wheel help without a clean fire? Yeah, stupid. But it was empty anyway, so... Just like the old gypsy woman said. Oh, nugget. Oh, this is Murakami, okay. I love all the booze we get at these things. Alcoholic, okay, noted. What about the f keep your complaining to yourself, Killjoy? Okay. They're already drinking and not out of glasses. They each have their own wine bottle. Wine bottle. Okay. Normally a fire like that, the house would be burning within three minutes. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah. No, they're just chilling. It's not time for reading whiteboards. It's fair. They're making themselves burnable. Yeah. Uh, happy retirement. We use the same banner for every retirement. Budget have to be cut somewhere, detective. Two slashed budgets explain why the sprinkler system isn't putting out the, the, the fire. That's <laughs> interesting. Why don't you go do some detecting, detective? I fucking will. Bye. Burn in hell. For all I care. I need to put that fire out before wandering around. How do I... P okay. I, I already am lost for words. Stairwell? No, I need to put out the fire. Do I have everything? We have the extinguisher, but it's not working. Fires are with no pressure. I need to repressure this first. How do you repressure? I don't know. I don't know how do you th this has some kind of thing. Apart from the hole that for the air supply, my king's trophy is actually a working airtight helmet. If I found the tube, I could get this back in action. Wait, this is connected. If I'm seen doing that, I'll never live in town. Okay. So it's a no? Do you want to do it outside? I'm sorry. Okay, you don't want to be seen like that. They might all become ghosts. Oh, yeah. Coffee. The wires. Okay. Brzezinski, there is a go away working. Okay. Okay. This is pressurized. This needs pressure. How? 
Java, Sweet Joe, Black Oil, Uncle Moomoo's Morning Surprise, a Liquid Viper. Coffee. Fair, sure. All of these. Oh, that's tough. I don't know how to pressurize. Bust fire extinguisher. Fun motor. And I can't go anywhere before I do that. So it must be made out of something I can do. How? Repressure this first. There is a lot of pressure on us. Sprinklers. They're broken. What's going on here? It's kind of crazy. Can of whipped cream. Wait. Hey, I wanted extra cream on my slice. Wait. We need to put it somewhere. The cream and then or just this and that. I can 100% say this is not something I expected to do today. This is what we're doing? This is how we're filling up the... Yeah. Fixed fire. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Sure. That was not on my bingo for today. That's that taken care of. Wait, what's that? What's what? Pile of gifts. That urn. What? Somebody died here. It's the Sims after all. Hello, Tip Top. How are you doing? How was your week? How was your um, birthday? Tell us everything. You mean our gift? Dooley, no, you didn't. Dooley, where did you get that? In that mysterious Chinese shop we visited last week. Investigated. We investigated it for gremlins. That seems like uh, like racial profiling to me. Dooley, he clearly had gremlins, which you then brought, bought, and brought to the station. Well then, case closed. Dooley, the lid was burnt off. The gremlins are missing, and the station is crumbling apart. Like I said, case closed. Dooley, we need to find them before somebody gets hurt. Here, take this. But cake! Oh, gremlin urn. Okay, we're gonna, I guess, collect gremlins? Okay, long time no see. Yeah. Take out menus, in fact, I'm seeing nothing work related in here at all. It's a party guy! It's a party guy! Relax! From what I can see, nobody else got him anything nice anyway. Sad. Let's investigate further, huh? Stay well. Oh, here's the Mac King with his luscious hair. Okay. And he said, hey, that's my kid's candy. Give it back. So I told him I was the mayor's husband. Then showed him my badge and fined him for obstruction of justice. <gasps> oh, you're so bad what are you doing ah <sighs> that'll be us one day detective you'll be mocking and i'll be damas you know what i mean we'll 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 be flirting on the staircase what what do you mean it must be so great for you to have a real detective like mac king around to learn from Watch streak three streams in a row. Thank you so much. Well, good morning to you. That's what I like to see. Thank you. Thank you. I don't have time to talk to you. Isn't there a walkie or something you should be arresting? That's not what whatever MacLame. Live long and prosper, dog. How dare you? I'm gonna put you to the ground. What's happening with those legs? Oh girl, you're an antelope. The staff bathroom, so horrible. People only enter for the most dire of emergencies. Oh, all right, then not going there, okay. Evidence room, hands off, Mac Lame. Something's broken. Something's broken the evidence door. Probably you and your idiot sidekicks fold. I'm going to fix it with my manly skills and muscles. If you really want to help, you can fetch me some more coffee. No need for sugar. Dallas is enough sweetness for me. 
<laughs> oh, you're so bad. I hate that man. <laughs> but he's so dreamy. Here's the coffee for you. I know you are good for something, Mark Lane. Will you open it now? Hands off. Yeah. Some more coffee. What? What? More coffee? He doesn't want us here, does he? <gasps> oh, there is Officer Cal! <clears throat> he was meant to be a sniffer dog, but somebody decided to train him only to sniff out candy. Ah, what fate. But think of all the candy-related crimes he's been able to help solve. True, we did have an alarming high rate of candy smuggling between legs. Good job, officer. Yeah. Yeah. Now that I don't need it, I find a working extinguisher. Ah, uh, shoot. There's nothing in here but laxatives. Isn't it what makes you go poop like crazy? Somebody put them here to suggest us cops are all full of shit. Twin Lakes Police Department. How can I direct your call? Oh. Oh, we're gonna put it into the coffee. I see. I see where that's going. Yes, yes. Paperwork. Hands off. My lunch is in there. Why is it hidden in work files? Nobody here will touch it. You're wise man, Banks. Very wise man. What do you want, detective? Can't you see I have reception desk to recept at? Sorry about that. Dooley, what do you think? Banks was my mentor when I joined the force. That's why they passed me down to desk cop. Oh. I'm sorry. Sorry to hear that. Hello, beautiful. Well, hello there, Noggy. Hey, what have you been up to? There's Doggy here. Doggo. Doggy here, Doggy there. <gasps> oh yeah, he's still there. Sleeping. Sleeping. Doggy, doggy, doggy. It was good busy. Oh, good to hear. Good to hear. All right, dispatch. Oh, there's a gremlin. <laughs> His name's Spike. Yummy, yummy wires. It's trying to hack the database and steal all human info. We should fry him, detective. Interesting idea. Why fry? Oh, I know why fry. Hello. Are you not bothered? You weren't working anyway, huh? Can't talk now, detective. The system's broken and I can't figure out why. Have you looked around you? I don't know much about how this all this works, but I know that's not right. Friday evening, 7pm, but crime never sleeps. As well, we take shifters. It is Friday evening, 7pm here too. Almost 8. But yeah, oh. But as well, we take shifts. And we're off on public holidays. Gotta take those rest days, detective. Yes. Take those rest days. Take those. Hmm. I don't know much about how okay this works. Whiteboard, this is the first bit of actual police work. I've seen this police uh, this place today, okay. How do we fry him? Alright. I don't know how electricity works, it's just confusing. Um, should I leave them here? Mug. It's a mug. A moral... A normal. Run of the mill mug. I don't know why I feel this need to comment on every item in a room. It's a... It's... It, yeah. Noggy 91! Yeah, that's much better. Yeah! I'll do it myself. Yes! 91. Amazing scores today. What a charming. Hell yeah. Awesome. The servers for the TLP. Ha! Bite. Ha! Ouch! Don't get too close, detective. That thing is biter. It's a biter. He just... I just got... Yeah, thanks to Lee. Thumbs up! These drawers are full of all sorts of rubbish. Like bobby pins. Actually, can I borrow one, Sally? You can, just have one. I won't want it back after whatever you do with it. Smart. Okay. So if I didn't click on that, then I was already like, yep, gotta go. Then we wouldn't get a bobby pin. 
anything else here. I don't know how to fry him without getting close to him. I would just unplug it, but well. Um, food for thought for later, I would say. Oh, deep top so strong. Yes, very nice, very nice. Thank you for so much, Leonis, for sharing this very nice aura of kindness and wholesomeness. I really, really adore that and I appreciate that. Thank you. Reception, holding cells. This is a very big place. Should we, before we do, okay, we're going all the way back for more coffee. Because I want to. <laughs> Spiked coffee. And you know what we're doing. We're going here and we're giving it to this dude. To this douche. Ooh, 88. Okay, nice. Nice. Thank you for making it. Oh, I'm happy with how it turned out. Yeah, but thank you for using it. Remembering about it. Thank you. <gasps> for how generous they are. Oh my. I don't think it's about me. I mean, it's more about you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh -huh. Keep the coffee coming, my claim. Oh, I could drink this stuff all the... Oh, oh no, get out of my way! Oh, poor boy. My insides make it stop! Okay, evidence room. Now to fix this with my manly skills and muscles. Ah, but mostly by finding a way to cheat this magnetic lock. Lock sounds like this. No. So we will need to do it with something else. Magnetic. Okay. Hmm. Spot of stream elements today. Yay! Has some good moments. Tilly, what do you think? Hey, detective? Yeah? I think you're a better detective than my king. Thanks, Tilly. That really means a lot. I think you're a better sidekick than Dallas. I don't have her legs though. Well, no, but if you did, that'd be the th that that'd be theft, wouldn't it? So many compliments, so many air vents. There is a serious draft coming from those vents. The bolts probably just need to be tightened up. Ah, okay. Oh, there is even more. Oh boy, seriously, why does he get all these nice things? A bulletproof sports car? Oh, the jerk. Oh, this is ours? Yeah. Our government issued a block with wheels. Oh. Oh. Oh, the Spatch's junction box is screwed closed. Oh, we have to unscrew it. Can we do it with a bobby pin? This pin is too small to pry this open. I need something bigger. Okay. Okay, but this is an idea. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, stairwell there. We've been there. But here, there's a builder. A lot of valves. Let's get the water flowing again in case another fire starts. Oh, shoot. The water pipes run all over the station, from the briefing room to the shooting range. But the system seems broken right now. Probably the gremlin's fault. Bioshock time. Alright. Is this how I think it works? It does. Okay. Let's try to make it work. Okay. Alright. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, as they say. Wasn't too hard. The sprinklers should be working now. You leave me out of work, QL. Oh, Gary. Could you do any work, please? That would be nice. So spare pipes for the works that's happening. Can we take it? Ah, a frog. Croak. Thank you, thank you. And a quack. 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 We need something new, don't we? Something to spend some fortune on. I have a feeling. Water pipes. Officer Dooley. Did you say something? I hope they're building a gym down here. I'd like to work out while I'm bunking off work. Yeah, if you're not working, you can do something for yourself. Pot of clay. <gasps> Ooh, a lump of cold hard clay. I've no use for this right now. But later. Mm -hmm. I think the tiny picket fence really makes this place seem homely. Good addition by the chief. Mm. You don't look very busy. 
power tools boss, so Union says, I don't work. Not my place to go against Union. You seem familiar, do I know you? Gary Plinkman. Not that I know of, no? You do seem familiar, don't you guys? Very oddly familiar. Mind if I borrow this? Why not? Can't seem getting back to work anytime soon. Monkey wrench. We needed monkey wrench for something. Fabulous Queenie. What? We all love them for how fabulous they are. <gasps> oh, that's so spot on. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Monkey. Oh, to add the monkey. Monkey sound. Okay. We could do that. Okay, the power tool. Yes, yes, yes. We needed the wrench. Oh, the monkey wrench. That's how it's called. Okay, my bad. Not the monkey sound, the monkey wrench. Mm. Okay, shooting range? <gasps> no, don't! <gasps> oh, shoot! No! How did you get a gun? Why is everything so unsafe in this station? Keep you. Never mind. I love him. We can keep this one. Can we keep this one? Targets. Looks like our guys. Sorry, I think I have mosquitoes in the room. They started biting. Looks like our guys are good enough shots to be stormtroopers. That's funny. That's funny. <laughs> they never, never get to the target. Funny. Targets, blah blah blah, sprinklers. The sprinklers are fixed now, but I need something to activate them. Right. Junction box. A junction box. Okay. Something to activate them. We need fire. I understand. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I understand. We need to set something on fire. Oop. Clicked off the game. Stairwell. Uh, 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 dispatch. Something needed screwing. Oh, it bit me again. Okay. Not here. I already don't remember. This is way way too big of a map okay holding cells i think that should conclude this place as a home i'm not sure holding cell one it must be very tasty or they were very hungry there was um, a lot of them not one is there a rat rave again this guy's in police protection for informing oh he was ratting somebody out I get that one. Nice. Okay. We put that up to cover the hole a prisoner dug to escape. Sadly for him, he dug his way into the rest of the station. What a stupid... Ah. Okay. Try not toilet. Your incarceration get you down. I'm tired. I don't like my job. Or it's just that I have to solve the case and it's Friday evening. Hi, Roy. Detective. I'm going to use my detective ing skills. Say you're in for solicitation. Impressive. Your guess not he's soliciting. Right, anyway, hand him over, Roy. Hand what over? Your matches and cigars. I wish I'd never met you, detective. We got some matches, okay, to set the fire, but we need to set fire to something. Did you hear? No, I'm not doing this. I just don't find toilets all that funny. Okay. Fair. Nothing else there. Oh, Tam! Here he is. We arrested him in the last case. Tam puts his name places so he knows what's his and what's not. All Tam loves to whittle. Whittle, whittle, whittle. Tam, you can't have a knife in prison. Right, yeah. Tam can and Tam has. I'm afraid they have to cons confiscate that. Tam does not have warmth for you in his heart. <gasps> oh my god, that's brilliant. Tam got a good aim, yeah. Denmark is extremely hit by mosquitoes this year, but weather has half been unusual. It is rather warm for 
September, isn't it? Rather warm. Seriously, what am I meant to say about them that isn't literally toilet humor? We have a knife. Okay. My spleen. No. Very warm. Yeah. The hose they use to loop through the cell door. Hand. Handles to lock the place up at night. Chief Scully really pulled this place into a sort of order, didn't she? What the? Oh my god. It's a lot of things. It's a lot of things. We were supposed to tie something up. Tighten something up. Let's get back. What needed tightening up? This needs to be fixed, but I don't know how. Okay, not that. What needed tightening? Do you remember, guys? Pinboard, radio globe. Oh, can we open these? No. Yeah, just checking. Just checking. Can't take the paper to set on fire. This is done. Ceiling fan. Mm. Wait! I have an idea. I said that we have to get something on fire. Maybe we don't. Maybe it just matches and near the sprinkles? They should achieve something. Yeah! It did! The creature is, um, wet. I don't know why I expected more from that. Yeah, me too. Can we electrocute it? I'm sorry. That's what it came to my... Getting a shower, yeah. It has a junction box. So, I think this is where it will go. This one, right? This needs screwing. Screwed closed. Oh, this is not how it works, does it? There are no bolts. I need to pry it open. Knife? Have you ever tried to, I don't know, open something like that just using a screwdriver? I've always been more of a lateral thriller. And it worked! Okay! Ah, big brain. I just need to find something to rewire this with. Okay, how about this? Okay, let's see. Okay, progress. <gasps> Another... Oh! More and more intricate puzzles. Okay. Okay. You guys are the electricians, man. No. I need to drag the wires from... Ah, uh, okay, I know. I know where it's going. From one note to the other same colored note without crossing them. I, I see. I see. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Reset it? Yeah, probably I can. Okay. How to play with that one though? No, I think I screwed it up already. It has to go first, doesn't it? Maybe not that way. How about here? Here. Ah, uh, and then that won't work. Oh, it can! Okay, never mind. Okay. Eek! I killed the gremlin. Yes, the system is back online. Time to do some hardcore cop work. This is a hardcore co cop work. It is. It is. We rock this. Yay! I'm smart. Smart. Smart girl. Smart elf. Sorry, just check the phone because it got a lot of notifications and it's just Friday evening and a lot of friends are streaming now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So we got this dealt with. Can we get him? It's passed out. Let's get this. Let's get it out of here. This patch gremlin. Yay. Can we put him into the urn? I don't want my colleagues seeing me on. Okay. Never mind then. Can we access something here? Hands up, detective. They just came back online. I won't risk them failing again. Okay. 
So what else can we push through with? Having the items that we have. Holding cells. This is unfinished business. That's just a trophy on my head without some air pipe. Hose? Plugging this into here gives me a diving helmet. Okay, and why would I use it here actually? Stupid. I'm only putting this on somewhere where nobody will see. I see. Can we throw it on him? No, and I take it. It's fair. Do garage, we took the wrench. I don't know. No? Metal door? Metal door? Oh, what was it saying? Nice and small for getting into tiny spaces. And this? There's a magnet in here. If I can find a way to pop it open. Oh, wait! Bobby? I think I can pry the shell off. Yeah, okay, okay. We got the magnet. Perfect. Okay, magnet here. Magnet should reverse the polarity on and let me in. And it did. Another gremlin. Okay, okay. Let's contain the excitement. Evidence. Who do you think wrote these dumb scripts for a comedy game about two cops investigating weird crimes? Nothing? Nobody? Shut up. What? <laughs> what? Okay, Dooley, how did that thing even get in here? This room is meant to be locked down. I'm just shocked. You see them. Like, see and understand them. Ah, little green man in the station. Right in my ballpark. Ballpark. I'm just shocked you're talking, you're taking it so well. This is a world apart from your normal boring cop life. It's exactly what I do for work. What we do for work, do we? For God's sake. Magical tome. I hope this illegal magical tome will be okay in here when the door is bust. A very noisy kids game. That's not evidence. I'm hiding it from Murakami until I beat his top score. <laughs> Paper sign. Dark side. Ooh. If I had any feeling out any feelings of guilt for sending Mac Kings. My king on his dirty timeout. I don't any longer. Hi. What's about this? Roleplay books, not actual contraband, but dangerous reading nonetheless. Roleplaying books, it's a contraband, but not too dangerous for our weekly game. Dooley, shh, shh. All that remains from the mysterious walking luggage. <clears throat> that ate everything case. Oh. Skull? A plastic skull. Okay, good. Surprisingly more dangerous a cold item than a real skull. Peculiar. That was very peculiar. Okay. Jars full of seamen. From the mysterious figure in the sailor case. Okay. Look out, gas. This could be handy if I want to be able to leave that party early. It's a gas grenade. Perfect. Okay. Powerful enough to knock out anyone in the small room. Like him? Hundreds and hundreds of tiny hats. A man made them to keep mice warm during the winter. But the mice turned out to be a gang of robbers, so we confiscated. We confiscated them. Oh no. No. <laughs> Alright. Macking stopless self portraits. He signed them in for the crime of being too awesome for the general public. Uh. A box of odd socks. Our best people are looking into a ring of crooked washing machines that are behind the robbery of their other halves. Classic. Boxes of jam jars with one scoop taken out from the unsolved scooper case where they appear at crime scenes after investigations had started. Well, that was me. I like eating toast while I think, but always forget to bring the pot with me afterwards so I could keep opening new ones. Harmless. No! 
It's not harmless. How can you, Tuli? We spent a lot of taxpayers' money investigating that. Harmless. Harmless. Okay, that's the same. That's two boxes already. Okay, should we talk about the Kremlin in the room? Chomp, chomp, claw face. It's so dangerous to get near. I need to find a way to knock it out. So that's perfect. That would knock me and Dooley out too. I need to find some protection first. Okay. How about that? Dooley, take this hose outside and keep the fresh air coming. We're doing it. Take this, you little monster. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, and it's it's taken care of. Oh, that was fun. While it's unconscious, I'll stuff it into my seemingly magical pockets. Classic. Okay, two of them. They have different hairstyles, huh? It's not the same. It's not copy paste. And I think that's it. If he didn't hide anything behind him, tiny hats. Yeah, a lot of tiny hats. Seaman. I can't make that out through this helmet. Yeah, that's fine. I think we've checked everything out. I'm taking this helmet off before I go out there. No need to walk around the station raising suspicion or being made fun of by everyone in the press present. No! Okay. Just don't inhale anything. Good job. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. So two out of three, and then we have a wrench. Can we just throw it at the guy? Don't want my colleagues seeing you. Now. Yay! Can we do something? He will be electrocuted. I am so sure of that. I just don't know how to do that. Reception. Can we go down? We can. No, we don't need anything from you. And I don't think there is anything else here. What do we need the monkey wrench for? What do you think, guys? What kinds of cells is this place holding? Human, animal, vegetable? Huh. All of them. Okay, we have a wrench. It will make sense. Maybe in the end it will. Okay, this is all repeat. We are not getting more laxatives. Oh, should we revisit the party? Right, we haven't been there for a while. Anything happened here, Wojinski? No talk. I'm working. Who lives ever, Wojinski? Go away. At least they're working now in case second fire breaks out for everyone to ignore. I'm seen doing that. Ah, shh. Where is the retirement guy? Oh, McNugget here, right? I don't know why we're celebrating yet. I've got two days left till retirement. We can't risk you not making it and us losing out on the party. I should be offended, but I do like a good party. Fair. Yeah, good, good, good. I love all the boos. Yes. Detective. Oh, okay. Now that we took care of the fire, maybe we can get more up from her. Did you see the fire, Chief? Of course, it was right there. And you didn't do anything? I'm fed up with my life, okay? What can I do? People want to re-gift the fires I got them last month. Then let them. Wait, you were the one who set those fires around the station last month? They were beacons of hope, okay? All very metaphorical. They were real fires. Metaphors can be very real. She's drunk. She's drunk. Somebody put her in a cell, please. Chief, why is Macking's office so much nicer than mine? You think our barely legal goblins and ghouls division should have a bigger office than Meyer's husband? 
Just be glad you're not down in the basement. Fair. I smell a pyromaniac. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Or maybe she's just drunk, not only during the parties. Thanks for supporting the Dark Side Division, Chef. Chief. Don't thank me, just keep the city clean of those oogie boogie men. And the oogie boogie women. And non binary oogie boogies. No discrimination in regards to oogie boogies. Okay? Except for the discrimination of keeping them out of Twin Lakes. Apart from that one, yes. <laughs> I think there might be gremlins loose in the station. Seriously, we just talked about this. You have one job. One job. No oogie boogies in Twin Lakes. This station is in Twin Lakes. Get this situation under control, detective. On the chief. No party for you two until this mess is cleaned up. Get to it. Uh... So one more. I came back here. And this is the hood. This is what we're supposed to pick up. Okay. I clicked on the vent, but not on the hood. Okay. I'll take this for my trophy cabinet. I mean, I'll take it to, the, to be repaired. Uh, yeah, that, that second one. Detective, how do you get all these things into your pocket? What are you going? Maybe this we can cover ourselves with? I didn't read that far. Can I protect myself? No. He's too far to hit with this. I'll need to find another way to make use of it. Back to checking I go, because I have no idea. What would we use it for? The hood. I have no idea. Yeah, I actually have no idea. They mentioned that the car was bulletproof. My hood from my king's car, bulletproof, but not air vent proof. I just have to angle it like this and it probably will shoot him back. Or do that. But I knew that he will be electrocuted, yeah. That was a shocking way to wrap this up. Yeah? Are you proud of that pun? More than I should be. How am I picking him up? But finally, Dooley. Grab the gun and I'll take this guy. I don't know. We didn't get electrocuted, but we got the guy. So that's good. Let's go. Let's get back to the office before somebody else sees us. Okay. Ooh, what a crazy one. Holy moly. Okay, let's lock these suckers into their new urn and get back to that party. Party! Party! Look, he's so sad. This guy shot at us. I have a mind to flush this one down the toilet. Oh, he's sad. They probably are both dead. Two electrocuted and one cast. In you go, sleepy monster. Back to captivity, my monstrous ball. And you welcome home, Lick. You didn't. Oops. Oops! Is that it? What do you want to do now? Flash them down the toilet and go back to the party? We need to make a new urn, a magical one that can actually hold them. <laughs> Yourself, gremlins again. Oh, There was a magical Dr. Smooch. Well, hello there. Hi, how are you doing? Long time no see. Um, I have an idea. There was a magic book here. Maybe there will be instructions in here for sealing magical urns. Let's see. Replace, cast it or not. A magical tome taken from the library. So, can I read it? something? Do, did we see another urn? Skull. Gas grenades. Do we need more? 
upgrade should be enough. Okay, fair. Ah, uh, all the remains from the mysterious walking luggage. Can't we just put them in here? I'm good at being on vacation. Ooh, where have you been? What is this gremlin game? This is Dark Side Detective. And this is just one of many cases. Um, fourth one, I believe. We set some goblins free at the police station. Now we caught them. We were supposed to seal them in an urn. But my fellow de non detective, cop, Dooley, Officer Dooley, uh, dropped it. So, yeah. Now we have to make, I understand, a new urn. Cypress, really? <gasps> I've never been. How was it? I hope the weather was nice. Can we get anything? I could get the bottle. You've not finished any of the bottles? No? Oh, sorry. No! Let me choose no. Goodbye. Goodbye. Wait. What if we make an urn? Wait, I have an idea. Garage. Maybe now we can take the clay. It's a good urn making material. Yeah! And go and make it. Okay, we're onto something. Back up. Go in here, here, here. And with clay, we can make a new urn. Worn. A new one. A new urn. Worn. It's too dirty to use. What do you mean too dirty? If I could find the right materials, I could make a new urn here. What other materials do you need? Besides clay, water, and then fire, right? Oh, the water we can have from here. A glass of cold refreshing. No, this is not warm. Oh, I've been put off coffee for a while. What else do we need? A lump of cold hard clay. Do we need to warm it up? What materials do I need? Cast it or not. Dirty. Didn't want water. There is one toilet for the whole station. It's filthy. So, that's a no. It's too dry to use. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Dry. That softened it up. Okay. Okay. Can I now use it? Let's do this. Okay, okay. Well, there was something very clear. Other than Time Circus. Ooh. Oh, I'm so jealous. So jealous. I'm happy you had a lovely time. Sunny every day. Oh, awesome. Awesome. How do you know how to make an urn? I watch that film, Ghost, a lot. For research. Sure. Now? Let's see. Warding ritual. Spells to bypass doing the dishes and uh -huh, a diagram for how to seal magical urns. Handy. Time for some finger crafting fruits. And we have a magic urn. Now, can we do that? One down. Yes. That's two. And that's done. Thank goodness. Let's get this somewhere safe. Okay. Look. Fixed and gremlin stashed away. What have we learned from this, Dooley? Mm. Not to eat so much sugar when I'm crashing. Uh, not so eat. Mm. Not to eat so much sugar. I'm crashing now. I don't really remember much of what happened, but I'm sure it was nothing important. You made this mess. Now let's get back to the party. Yay! No fire anymore. Hey, where's all the cake gone? We ate it all. Why is this place a mess? What did you two do? Well, there was... And <laughs> we... Somebody let off a gas grenade. Nasty big pointy teeth. <gasps> the car was smashed when we got there. My king did it? <sighs> Another one to file under dark side antics. Probably for the best, yes. Okay, well... You two better start cleaning. The budget doesn't allow for both your capers and custodial stuff. What? Scully? Scully? 
Oh man, chores and no cake? This day did not play out the way I hoped. But case closed. We did it. Again, stumbled here again. A little bit. Oh, Loch Ness. Tempting. But that will be for the next one. So. Yay! Did it. Nice. Good job. X Files reference. Nice! Didn't catch that. I was talking about it uh, not that long ago, but I have not actually watched any of the X Files. Good game. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, but this is where we're gonna stop for today. So, dear VOD watchers, thank you so much, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye, bye.